We have since created the uh, Bill Nichols Award, uh, a very special award uh, from the OAC. And this year, I am pleased uh, to uh, announce that Joe Tate is the recipient of the Bill Nichols Award. Uh, Joe is with us, and we appreciate that very much. And he is with, as I've heard him say many times, his lovely bride, Jean. Thank you so much for being here with us. Uh, Joe was the voice of the Cleveland Cavaliers since the team came into existence in uh, 1970 up until his retirement in 2011. He broadcasted Cleveland Indians baseball for 16 years. The Basketball Hall of Fame honored him with the prestigious Kurt Gowdy Media Award a couple years ago. Joe has authored his memoirs called Joe Tate, It's Been a Real Ball. Uh, he is a graduate of Monmouth College, and I think probably one of the reasons why he embraces us, uh, just like Bill Nichols did, is because he came from a small school and understands uh, the charm, the significance, and the beauty of it. And so Joe is one of those guys who has never forgotten uh, his roots and also embraces us on our level and we are very, very grateful for the fact that for the last 26 years, he has lent his time and talents to the Mount Union football and basketball programs. Joe, thank you so much for being here. And most important, thank you so much for caring about us. We appreciate it. Please come on and accept your award. 56 years ago, I broadcast my first game at Monmouth College. Since that time, I have gone up the ladder, and now I've made it full circle. They say life is a series of circles, and this circle has brought me back to Mount Union and to the OAC. I sincerely hope, and I know that the coaches and administrators understand this, and I hope the athletes will as well, you've got something very special here in Division Three and in particular the OAC, and I have been thrilled to be part of it. It's a great way to go out with you fellas and the brand of sports that you play. And this award makes it even nicer. Thank you very much.